Uh, my name is Anthony Owens. Uh, I've been in Jai now about five and a half, almost six years. Uh, we've just recently moved to this new location. Uh, we started here uh, on January 1st, uh, building and taking everything down. Uh, we just recently, about a month and a half now, got the veggies up and running. Uh, previously, we were in cooperation with the community college. The great thing here is uh, we live in a community where there's lots of locals. Uh, they come in, uh, they, they harvest the vegetables, they see what we're doing, uh, they introduce more people, they bring their kids, and this helps introduce to the kids where their food is coming from. Uh, it's a really incredible process to see them see this new way of farming. It's probably going to be the future of farming. Uh, it's sustainable, it's environmentally friendly, it's chemical free, uh, you know, the modern farmer and all farmers, they really have a hard life and kind of understated, but you know, the stuff they've been taught to use, the chemicals in this and that, we need to stop that. We need to clean the earth, we need to clean the soils. Uh, this kind of farming is the way to go. You know, we save over 90% of the water. We have 30 to 60% increased production times uh, and it's all natural and people can be a part of it. You can do it in your homes, on your rooftops, in your kitchen, it's great. We decided to bring bees here because we thought, even I'm allergic to bees, people need to know bees are important. Bees produce such a massive amount of our fruits and vegetables and with all the chemicals we're doing, they're dying, um, people are scared of them, they don't understand them. So by bringing bees here and having education here, we can influence the people about what the importance of the bees are and why we need to have them, why we need to protect them. Well, my family and me, uh, my wife and my son, my son is uh, seven years old, just turned seven. Uh, my wife is Taiwanese, she's from a local city called Baihe. Uh, we live in Jai City, which is great for families. You know, her mom's retired and we thought, you know, we can make this a real family thing. So her mother helps us uh, seed the stuff and you know, my wife delivers and contacts customers and works at the farm and my son's out here enjoying nature the way it should be. I think for the next six months to a year, uh, really secure this area up, uh, really start to spread our name, get people involved. We always welcome people to come anytime. Uh, you can always contact us through our Facebook at Formosa Greens. Um, our Chinese name is Lur Feiyo. And we welcome anyone to check us out, to come down and see you got to be careful, I'll feed you raw vegetables.